Hey guys, this is Nestor File. This is the Wandering Beardo. And I'm on my way to a welcome event. That's right, it's a welcome event for people who are new to Brantford as a city. Uh, there are a number of things that you can learn about the city, understand, and uh, people you can get to know. So I'm going to take this opportunity to um, make the most of it. This is about two kilometers from where I am and I'm headed there now. So it's a bit of a walk and that's the road there. So yeah, let's go and have a look at what this event is like. And the thing about Canada is you can actually walk and you won't feel as exhausted as you would anywhere else. I'm slightly out of breath because as you can see, hang on. This is a bit of a steep slope that I walked up already. So I'm slightly out of breath, but enjoying it nonetheless. Getting my steps in for the day. <laughs> okay guys, looks like we're at the entrance of the park. Gotta go walking down that way. I could see some cars parked, so should be the right direction. There's a map, a city map. That's good. Oof. Just look at this. Look at that. How gorgeous is this? I mean, you can drive all the way in, but I'm thinking, why would you when you can walk? is it it says welcome to Mohawk Park park hours are from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. that is a park whoa that is the parking upstairs I mean upstairs there's parking right there and there's some parking up ahead and it's literally all woods I'm gonna walk on this side so I don't get jumped by a bear I don't think there are bears, but I don't know. Okay, I don't know if you can see it. Hang on, I'm gonna try and zoom in. Yeah, look at that. Oops. People with cars driving in. Had I realized that this was going to be so beautiful, I would have got my bloody GoPro. But that's alright. That's alright. You're still getting to see something, right? You're still getting to see how beautiful this park is. Look at that. So already I can see there's a play area for the kids down there. I can see... Is that a badminton net? I think it's a badminton or a volleyball net. Oh, it's really nice. I'm going to keep following the trail. It says the pavilion. That's where the event is. And honestly, even if we didn't get the event, we're pretty happy because of the kind of um, the nature that's here. I'd still be happy. I'd still be happy wandering through this 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 park and taking it all in. So yeah. You can see some kids biking out there. In the distance, I don't know if you can see them. People walking. Uh, I think the pavilion's down this way. It's gonna go down that way. Just look at that. It's really, really beautiful. Born in this park, and this is a huge park. Can you see the play area there? Just look at the play area there. We'll go check that out in a bit.
So this park has multiple of these viewpoints and I'm gonna walk down one of these because it's so cool. And uh, this is right by, I think this is the river. I think this is the river, it's so beautiful. I think you can go down by the stream. Yeah, you can. There are trails. You can go all the way down one of these trails. Uh, it's really nice. It's really nice. I'll walk down here and just show you the stream. Oh, look at that. Look at that. And there's a space for you to sit. It's a bit wet because it drained. How cool is this place, guys? This is really beautiful. And if you thought the park I had put up the last time was good. Oh man, this is insane. This is like a, this is like literally in the middle of a forest. Okay. Check that out. So, um, this was more like, a, so the welcome event was more like a fair of sorts where different organizations, whether they're providing employment services, services for seniors, whether they're educational institutions like schools and colleges, they were all here. Um, you also had uh, oh, free food. Free food. Uh, you also had um, career, I mentioned career services, but you also had um, like mental health and well-being and stuff around that. There was also government uh, agencies that were um, that were meeting people and trying to get feedback, trying to understand what could be done differently. There were games. So very, very cool. Very nice. Uh, I think it's an interesting way of welcoming people into the community. It's an interesting way of also telling people uh, these are the kind of things that we have available uh, these are the services that you can avail pretty cool You got a picnic area. <clears throat> That's good. And we're walking back home. We're almost there. Super cloudy day. Very interesting. I mean, it's fun. Uh, walking around in this kind of an atmosphere where it's cloudy, it's overcast, means it's not very hot, it's nice and breezy. Um, you can wear a t-shirt if you're alright with like 14, 15, 16 degrees uh, temperatures on days like these especially. I started off with my um, hoodie on, but then I took it off because it was, I think I'm getting used to and acclimatized to the environment here and I'm, I'm quite enjoying it. So yeah, almost home, another two or three blocks more, we'll be there. Now this is an interesting thing that I thought I'd uh, show you guys, is there's like a playground right there. And this is actually a space that they provided for people to, you know, if you've got newspapers or cardboard boxes and stuff, um, that's a space that they provided for the community to actually go and uh, and those are the trucks that are backing up over there, but yeah. It's a space they provided for the community to go and put down their uh, cardboard and, and newspapers to recycle, and that's free. So as long as you can lug it, you know, and get it here, you're fine. And for me, it's a couple of blocks from home, so pretty good, so yeah. You see, that's the street I live on. So that's all for today's video, guys. I hope you had a good time. Uh, I'm going to be making a lot more vlogs like these. I hope you enjoyed them. If you did, please do like, share, subscribe, um, tell your friends about us. 
And that's all for today. So see you in the next video. Bye-bye.